All right, so I have another PlayStation 5 here. Check this out. You plug it in. It beeps three times. And then you try to turn it on. Nothing really happens. Let's go take this thing apart and uh, I'll show you how to fix it. We don't have the warranty sticker, meaning somebody was inside. Yeah, definitely somebody else was in here. Uh, hopefully they didn't do uh, any other damage. Yeah, they did damage this cable right here. Look at that. And honestly, this damaged cable could cause this problem. So I'm going to go and test it just like this. Look. All right, so I plugged it up here and I didn't hear any beeps and uh, it powered on. So our problem here was with this cable. Just to test my theory out, I plugged the cable in and uh, yeah, the cable is okay, even though it looks bad and the system is on. Uh, what a weird system. I fixed it. <laughs> okay, I put uh, the rest of it together just to test it here, and uh, we have it on the screen. I think this is what happened. When I was trying to shoot this video, I was uh, playing around with this and pushing it in and out, and uh, this original problem is with the firmware chip. And so it seems that there's some sort of mechanism here that when, when I was playing around with it, it didn't have enough time, and I got lucky where the firmware chip has a mechanism of reflashing the area where it's starting to read the uh, first sector for it to start. And it actually did that as I was um, playing around with the power. So this is not recommended, but if you have the three beeps of death, you can uh, try to plug and unplug your system a few times and uh, maybe you can get lucky. Because literally that's all I did here was um, untangle that wire so that could be a problem that uh, you know I fixed untangling the wire and I was playing around here